Okay, here we are. We're down here in the bat cave of my basement. Uh, electronics. This is my son's business here. Display dimensions. We build uh, scoreboards for wrestling. These are what they look like here. This is his poster with his uh, business number and stuff on there. We've got the control center. Lots of electronic parts. Lots, lots of electronic parts. Wall chart. Some lab equipment. Test scope. And here we have what we're working on. Here is a. Uh, this is an instrument cluster from, a, I believe it's an 05 Cavalier. And what happened is our uh, our Prindle or our odometer display, rather, it's just odometer, not a Prindle. The uh, backlight burnt out on it, and that would be this little bugger right here. So what I did was I uh, desoldered it from the circuit board, and then I bent the, uh, just kind of gently bent the display forward so I could get it out. It solders on right over there on that spot. And just desolder it from the back side, from right there. And then I got a, I got access to all sorts of spare instrument clusters. So what I did was I desoldered a bulb off of this one after testing it to make sure that they're good. And I got that little bulb right here. So what we're going to try to do is uh, solder this bulb back onto the uh, back onto the display here and gently move this thing back over and hopefully we will have with a little bit of effort have saved an instrument cluster so again what's really nice to have for these kind of jobs is a uh, a soldering iron where you got temperature control this isn't a desoldering iron it's just a regular soldering iron but uh it works well enough for a job like this so okay well if I get this to work, I'll post a picture and a tip of it working.